Thank you for having me. My name is Aradhna Kwala. I am CEO and founder of a private client advisory called Aptomind Partners. Bulk of my work is advising um, heads of states, prime ministers and presidents on how do you use tourism as a force for good. In addition, I sit on the board of multiple companies, some of them public, some of them uh, private. Um, in the kingdom, I am uh, the chair of the global advisory board for the Red Sea project, the Red Sea and Amala. And I am the former managing director of tourism at Neom, and I also sit on the board of um, another company called Elaf Group, all of who are here, which is absolutely fantastic. Indeed. And today's event, the Future Hospitality Summit, uh, has been an amazing turnout. It has been sold out days before the event even started. Tell us the importance of a summit such as uh, this one and the importance of the hospitality uh, segment. So, uh, look, quite frankly, I think there are very few conferences and events which brings leaders from wider region and also from Saudi Arabia and leaders who are on the verge of transformation and change. So I think this is the place to be if you are keen on what's happening in the kingdom and if you're keen or an active participant uh, who is invested and following the change that's happening in the kingdom. Indeed and from your expertise and everything what advice will you tell even the youth or even the lady the, the female population into the hospitality sec uh, segment, what advice will you give them? Uh, quite a few advice. So I'm here because I am speaking at a panel tomorrow which fascinating enough is about uh, gender diversity and we are very unusual as a sector because we have more than 50% women in our sector but we have less than 5% women who go on to become CEOs and members or chairs of the boards. So I think there's a real gender diversity problem in our sector and I think it's absolutely fantastic that a conference and event like this is not just talking about gender diversity but giving it a top slot at a conference. So very excited to be here and also talking about these things. Um, and when, when it comes to the youth and the women in Saudi Arabia, I think the future is uh, really infinite potential. When you have a country where 70% of the population is below the age of 35, really um, it's infinite. Indeed, and thank you so much for joining us in this prestigious summit. Thank you so much. Thank you for having me.